What up guys, it's Raw again, back with another review. Today I'm gonna review the new Yeezys Zebras. Let's go. Yeah. Mojo on the beat, bitch. I had a bitch with a curb. Little bitch, you a curb. Get on the curb. It ain't shit for me to spread, but you really don't deserve. Bitch, I'm a dog. Roof, roof with the claws. Adding commas, no pause. Trap out the mall. All the kids do is ball. Two benches for the draws. Bitch, I'm the dime. Don't be trying to waste my time. Baby girl, know she fine. Yeah, she a dime. All these salty niggas mad. I ain't even in my prime. I'm finna shine. King Lowe's got the nine. T smooth, keep the prime. Shine got the cane. Diamonds blinging off my chain. Swear Mojo on the range. range. Yeah. Bitch. Our roof in the rain. Yeah. yeah. She giving me face. What can I say? Everything 1K. What? Everything 1K. Yeah. Everything 1K. Yeah. Everything 1K. Yeah. Mojo on the beat, bitch. Swag. Bitch, I'm ballin'. I ain't wanna cop the red, but it seemed like that bitch was calling. Yeah. He ain't gay. He. That right there is ridiculous. As my Italian bros would say, yo, bro, these are mental. Mental, bro. Shout out to my Italian friends. Um, I'm not gonna lie. The first time I saw these. I didn't really like them. I saw them and I was like, yo, what the fuck are these LMFO sneakers? LMFAO ain't even cool anymore. And now their sneakers are coming back. Honestly, the first time I saw these, I didn't like them. I didn't like the zebra print. I don't really like animal prints. If this was like a tiger print or a leopard print or any animal print. Like, nah, man, I don't like no animal print. I ain't gonna wear no animal print on my body, especially on my feet. Hell no. But then I kept seeing people posting pictures of themselves on the Instagram and I was like, yeah, these are actually pretty sick. I saw Hypebeast and Snapshots and all these Instagram posts and I was like, hey, these are actually not bad. They look good on foot. So I was like, yo, I gotta get these. And another thing that intrigued me is that these are unique. There are a lot of Yeezys V2s that are out now and there's not a lot of them that are actually look kind of different you know what I'm saying the blue guys are different um, the blue guys are different that's about it every other v2 looks kind of like the same you know what I'm saying the cream is kind of different but it's just all white um, but these ones this is dope this is different this is this is something you just take out and you want to just put in your glass case and just look at it with a light spotlight and display you know what I'm saying it's like you don't even want to wear these I, I tried them on they're s extremely comfortable um, yeah I can put on anything and I will look good and it would go you know we're in a day and age now where people just don't like to match anymore and you just put on anything so these work perfectly and not to mention they're extremely comfortable so yes, if you guys like Yeezys, I recommend that you guys go out and get this, like right now. If you couldn't get them at retail, uh, it might be good to try to get them at resale right now because I remember the first time they re uh, the first time these came out, the resale value went up to two k, went up to two thousand dollars on its, on on uh, what is it, uh, Flight Club, two thousand dollars US, ridiculous. Now the resale, because they re-released them. Is at 600 600 to 700 Canadian right now but I know the retail went down a lot but I know it will eventually go back up if you guys remember the pirate blacks they came out uh, resale went up and then they re-released them resale went down but right now if you if you go out there and look for the pirate blacks you're not gonna get them anywhere under a thousand US and that's a fact the price the prices went back way up again I feel like these ones are gonna be the same thing um, I feel like once um, everyone wears them out and there's uh, not much real, uh, not much new ones out there in the market, these ones are gonna go straight back up. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying it's gonna go back up to 2k US, but I know it's gonna go back up over at least 1k US. So if you want them and you couldn't cop them, and you have some money and you have some money aside, I suggest y'all go out there and get them right now at the price that they're selling at resale right now. So that's it. I don't know if you can see on the camera. Uh, it's, it's one of those focus lens, so if it's not like lined, you won't, you know, if it's in front of here, it's gonna be blurry, or if I'm in front, my face is gonna be blurry. So I gotta put it right next to my face. The detail, it's right here. It's beautiful. You got the 350 supply on the side in red, and then you got the white swoosh, well, the white, the white line here with the, the zebra prints. It's just beautiful, guys. In person, it's a lot nicer. 
I mean, in pictures they're already nice, but in person they are a lot, lot nicer. They're extremely, they even smell good. So that's it, guys. Um, thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. Like I said, um, I'm doing this for fun. And uh, so if I come out here, find some time, and make a couple videos, and, and, and have you guys out there watching it and enjoying the video, I appreciate that. It just gives me an incentive to just want to keep on making more videos because I know that there are some people out there who are actually enjoying my videos. So again, from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys for watching the videos. I appreciate it. Hopefully I'll be able to get some more releases so I can come out here and do the, do the unboxing and reviews of uh, these sneakers or anything else for that matter. So that's it. I just want to say thank you guys for watching this video. And uh, until next time, have a great day. I love you guys. Take care. Bye. Mojo on the beat, bitch. I hit a bitch with a curb. Little bitch, you a curb. Get on the curb. It ain't shit for me to spurge, but you really don't deserve. Bitch, I'm a dog. Roof, roof with the claw.